Hello dear students, in this small video we will uh, derive an expression for gravitational potential energy of a particle due to earth. Okay. So what is gravitational potential energy? Potential energy is basically work done. Okay. So gravitational potential energy at a point due to earth is the amount of work done in displacing the particle from infinity to that point in gravitational field provided you should bring the particle with constant speed. Okay. <clears throat> now let us try to uh, analyze the situation. Say this is earth here. Okay. Mass of earth is M E. At a radial distance R from earth. Okay. So we will uh, consider a point P. I am interested in finding the gravitational potential at this point P. So how to calculate? I have to calculate the amount of work uh, done in displacing the particle from infinity to that point I should calculate this work but as you can observe if the particle is at infinity the gravitational force between that particle and the earth is zero when you bring that particle closer and closer to the earth the gravitational force increases that means there is a variable force now okay so now what I'll do, I will consider some, so in the, whenever there is a variable force, I know that work done is definite integral of force over displacement means I should use integration. Now what I'll do, I'll consider two intermediate points, okay, point A and point B. I'll calculate the work required in displacing the body of mass M, okay, from point A to point B. That displacement is very, very small, okay, that displacement I take it as del dx, okay. And the corresponding work done in that process is dw, very very small work done. So I will calculate that dw, then I will uh, uh, then I will calculate the total work required. Okay, so what is I will write the equation for dw, dw is equal to dw is equal to f dot dx, f dot dx means f dx cos theta, f dx into cos theta. Okay, so work done, so I am doing work here. So angle between work done by the external agency, <coughs> angle between the uh, external force, okay, angle between the external force and displacement is 0 degree, hope you can understand, I am trying, trying to displace the particle from infinity to this point, so angle between the force and the displacement is uh, 0, therefore I will write cos 0 here, so therefore what happens, dw <coughs> will be equal to f d x dw is equal to f dx so to calculate total work done now what i should do so total work required is equal to integration of dw between the limits infinity and r because from here to here i should displace the particle so that is equal to so integration of f dx between the limits infinity and r okay when the mass is at point a say the distance between the earth and that point okay let it be x okay so at this moment what is the force force is equal to g into m1 mass of the earth into mass of the particle m1 m2 divided by r square means distance between the two masses so that is x now x square into dx between the limits infinity and r so what happens W is equal to G is constant, mass of earth is constant, mass of particle is constant, it can be taken outside. Then 1 by x square can be written as x to the power minus 2 between the x to the power minus 2. So integration of x power minus 2 with respect to x between the limits infinity and r. Right? So this will be equal to g into mass of earth into mass of the particle integration of x power n is equal to x power n plus 1 divided by n plus 1 okay so we have integrated it between the limits infinity and r so w will be equal to simplification okay w is equal to g m e into m okay so this minus 2 plus 1 will be minus 1 minus 2 okay so what happens x power minus 1 divided by minus 1 between the limits infinity and r that would be equal to this minus i can write it here so minus g m e into m x power minus 1 can be written as 1 by x okay 
between the limits infinity and r so what happens w work done will be equal to work done will be equal to minus g into m e into m into first i'll apply the upper limit in the place of x i'll write upper limit 1 by r minus 1 by infinity so what is 1 by infinity 1 by infinity is equal to 0 so work done is equal to minus g m e into m divided by r so according to the definition okay work done in displacing the body from infinity to r itself is gravitational potential energy therefore i can write by definition by definition of uh, gravitational potential energy i can directly write okay so gravitational potential energy u is equal to minus g m e into m divided by r <coughs> so this the equation of gravitational potential energy can be used in general in general gravitational potential energy for any planet is equal to minus g into mass of that planet into mass of the particle divided by r this negative potential energy okay this negative potential energy indicates that the uh, the force is attractive thank you very much